In this video, I wanted to show you a quick tip on multitasking on a Google Chromebook. Um, this feature is also available in a Windows 10 computer, so if you've got one of those, um, you can do the same, same task. So here I am on my Google Chromebook. Again, I can tell that I'm on a Google Chromebook because my icons on the taskbar are in the center. Also, I've got this rounded edged uh, taskbar and I don't have the Windows logo in the bottom left-hand corner. And when I click on this, I get a search box in the middle of the screen. So on my Google Chromebook, what I want to do is I want to be able to multitask and take advantage of split, uh, splitting the screen. So what I can do is here I've got two tabs open in Google Chrome. And what I'm going to do is I'll click on the second tab and hold. So I'm left click and hold. And then I'll take and drag that away from the browser. So now I've got this windowed browser. And what it does is it pulls that back into full screen once I've pulled it away. So now I've got two different, uh, two different browsers open. So, and I could toggle between the two if I go and click on it. Or if I, on the keyboard, uh, on, just above the six key, I can switch between the two windows. All right, so now what I was mentioning earlier is that I wanted to take advantage of split screen. So, so let's imagine I'm on a Teams call and one window is the Teams call, but I may need to do something on, uh, let's say, uh, EasyBridge um, or Study Island or something like that. So it's not very efficient for me to hit this key and switch between the lesson and then switch and go back to the second window. So a more efficient way to do this would be to take advantage of split screen. So how do I do that? So if you take and move that uh, browser away from the top, just like we did and we get this window, and I actually, if I take and pull it over here on the right hand side and just keep going until I hit the right uh, edge of the screen. Notice what happens. I get this, I get this kind of light colored box on the uh, right half of the screen. And if I release while I'm on that side, it actually snaps my browser to the right hand side of the screen. And then I can take this other browser and I can take and do the same thing on the left hand side of the screen. Now, once I've done this, I can actually resize these a little bit and make it fit a little bit better. So let's say I've got my Teams call over here and then I've got my Study Island over here on the right hand side so I don't need quite as much space. So this would be a good way to, to multitask and do uh, you know two different windows at the same time so that way um, you don't have to toggle between the two different screens.